Okay, in production, sometimes we face this kind of problem where my image has some background, colored background and alpha information. So what we normally prefer, pre-multiply this image with alpha. Okay, so I use tab and pre-multiply. Okay, so to actually what it is, it multiply alpha value with his RGB value so we get this kind of output but see whenever we have color background we face this each problem so today I am going to show you how to solve this problem the workflow for this problem and the logic behind this problem okay so to study this problem I have already one pre-multiplied image okay, over there I'm not getting this kind of problem and one background that color background okay so now I merge this pre-multiplied image with my background so I get the same output that we render with this okay so now see to merge this green background or color background with my pre multiplied image I used blending mode over okay now see here I see some mathematical operation or mathematical calculation behind every blending mode so I see the blending mode over and I get that a plus b into 1 minus small a the small a represent alpha of your a or say foreground and what I get my final result okay now in our case we have this final result and background color and also alpha of this image so I get this small a and what we have to find is this a so simple mathematics apply on this formula so for a I get this final output minus B into 1 minus a so first of all I prefer to find this 1 minus a so 1 minus a means the invert of my alpha so right now I delete this thing and here I apply invert and I only apply invert on my alpha channel okay so normally this is my by default alpha and through invert I get this in output okay now next step I have to multiply this information with my background color or background gradient so for that I use a very simple method I use one copy node okay A and B so I use alpha of this node and my background from my background color node so here my background and in a, is alpha I got 1 minus a okay and to multiply this thing I use 
pre multiply node okay so i get this so now we got b into 1 minus a now to get my final what i have to do this final result minus this one and this is what b minus b into 1 minus a so i get one more merge node this is my a and this is my b and i just minus this thing so now see i remove that age issue with this simple operation okay you can create gizmo for this workflow for example here i have one image okay while applying pre multiplied i got this kind of issue and here i create one gizmo i name it as pre and pre multiply here what i have to do just define this background color and see so with this workflow and this logic you can easily manage your age issue